When people who have criticized a stock for a long time then suddenly start praising it, that's a great sign. This usually happens when there's a big event that triggers growth. In August, Jim Cramer in the Fast Money Halftime Report panel talked about Tesla and even though Cramer used to love Ford, he said Tesla is his new favorite stock. He thinks Tesla has hit rock bottom and predicts the stock price will go up significantly in the coming years. Jim Cramer, a well-known American TV host and investor, is famous for his show Mad Money. He loves the stock market and is a big fan of Tesla. In a recent interview with CNBC, he was asked which automaker he would buy instead and he surprised everyone by choosing Tesla. It's worth mentioning that even though Kramer used to be highly optimistic about other automakers like Ford, he has always been a big fan of Tesla. So, how did Tesla become Kramer's favorite stock? Let's dive in and find out. Jim Cramer used to think it was a clever of Ford CEO not to spin off their EV business. He believed that ICE vehicles generate a lot of money. At that time, Kramer thinks that Jim Farley, the CEO of Ford, would outperform Elon Musk by 2026. This is because Ford recently announced that they plan to produce 2 million cars per year, which would be a remarkable achievement. Kramer also said Ford's goal of generating 10% adjusted operating profit margin by 2026 is impressive. It's worth noting that Ford sold only about 64% of its all-electric Mustang Mach-E crossover globally in 2021 and posted a 7.3% adjusted operating profit. So in the past, Kramer advised Tesla investors to sell their shares rather than hold them for a long time. However, now he thinks that Tesla is a sleeping giant. This is because Ford recently missed Wall Street's fourth quarter earnings expectations. CEO Jim Farley admitted that the company could have done much in 2022, leaving around $2 billion in profit that were within its control. In contrast, Tesla exceeds expectation with its fourth quarter earnings. Elon Musk, the CEO of Tesla, revealed that orders for January were the strongest in the company's history, nearly twice the rate of Tesla's global production. As a result, Jim Cramer has chosen Tesla over Ford and GM, citing that Tesla has no insider selling, which he believes is good for the company. Despite receiving a couple of price target cuts from analysts, Tesla's shares had been on the rise, with Jim Cramer indicating that Tesla may be immune to negative costs coverage at current levels. Other analysts also see great potential for the automaker in the near future. According to Jim Cramer, Tesla's rally is due to a batch of strong company earnings. As investors digest the earnings and new gross domestic product data, Tesla's stock price has been rising. Jim Cramer believes that during earnings season, what matters is companies and their CEOs who should be smart enough to direct them given that the US economy grew by a higher than expected 2.9% in the fourth quarter. He added that the economic data did not drive the trading season's rallies, contrary to what many believe. Speaking on the topic, Kramer cited that the industry is an earning season and so stocks are doing well because many of them delivered good numbers. He claims that being on constant negative autopilot because you just pay attention to the Federal Reserve is rather confusing. According to Kramer, Tesla's price costs are no longer news and the business has the resources to do so. He stated that he doesn't want to bet against Tesla when the company's stock is down and only a few investor would want to do that. Hey there, this is Jules. If you've made it this far into the video, congratulations! You're already ahead of the game when it comes to understanding the latest updates on stock market. But wait, there's more! In the second half of this video, we'll dive even deeper into the specific of Tesla's recent performance and discuss what it means for investors like you. So, keep watching if you want to stay on top of the latest trends and get a leg up in the stock market game. You won't want to miss it! Many analysts are now increasing their price targets on Tesla's stock despite previous negative sentiment. Tesla has experienced significant struggles in the past year, resulting in multiple drops in their stock. However, the release of their fourth quarter results demonstrated record-breaking numbers, signaling a solid start for the company to earn big profits this 2023. Even though some investors claim that the result did not meet expectations, Tesla shares have increased multiple times this year. While the stock was down by over 60% in the past year, it has started to rise, especially after recent price cuts in China and the US. Jim Cramer observed that the high-quality tech companies, including Microsoft, Amazon, and Apple, which led the digital transformation journey, were affected by the FED's rate hikes last year. He stated that these stocks had exaggerated valuations and suffered losses when the FED tightened the monetary policy. 
The current economic downturn has taken a toll on many automakers as they had struggled to maintain their production and sales. In March, Musk cautioned that Tesla was experiencing significant inflation pressure in raw materials and logistics. Price cuts in China may have followed Musk's observation that the market was experiencing recessionary tendencies. Despite this, there is no reason to be alarmed. In fact, Tesla reported robust demand and sales in the fourth quarter of 2022 and has continued to make even more and better sales this year. Here. The car company plans to substantially boost the global production of its top-selling Model Y and Model 3 electric vehicles in this year's fourth quarter. It aims to sustain this growth in 2023 as newer factories in Austin and Berlin scales up production. If Tesla achieves its production targets, it will move closer to the scale of the German automaker BMW by the end of 2023, according to Musk. The automaker is expected to have a huge catalyst to look forward to with its new vehicles platform. In a press release, Tesla announced that it plans to host its 2023 Investor Day at its factory in Texas, where investors will be able to see its most advanced production and discuss long-term expansion plans. The event will also include talks about capital allocation, including the stock buyback program that Musk initially announced in October. Brad Winson, chief futurist at ARK Investment Management, believed that if Tesla successfully produces this low-cost EV, it will set the standard for the market just as it has done with its previous model. Finally, Jim Cramer explained his rationale for future stock pricing amidst consistent inflation, rampant interest rate hikes, COVID-19 lockdowns, and Russia's invasion of Ukraine. He believes that beaten down tech stocks can make a comeback once the Federal Reserve stops its fiscal tightening. According to Kramer, big tech, top cloud plays, and well-run chip makers like AMD and Nvidia will be the better bets. While he analyzed stocks with a potential for a massive comeback, he also noted that some pandemic stocks may not recover from previous lows. Despite backing Tesla in November, investors are still closely watching the stock as selling pressure has increased in recent months. Although the stock is trading below is expected valuation, some longtime Tesla supporters see the value in their lowered price. As they prepare for whatever may happen in the next year, analysts are highlighting the downside potential in Tesla shares. Thanks for watching the video till the end. Now that you have better understanding of Tesla's stock performance and the factors affecting it, what do you think about investing in Tesla? Do you think it's a good long-term investment? Let me know in the comments below. If you found this video informative and helpful, leave it a like and subscribe for more informative content. Don't forget to hit the notification bell to stay updated with the latest uploads. Also, if someone you do know finds this video helpful, share it with them. Thanks again for watching. If you want to know more about next big thing in Tesla Energy, check out this video.